Hello English learners. Welcome back to Des English. Today, we're going to explore the differences between by, until, and by the time. These are common English prepositions that are often used to talk about time. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of when to use each one. Let's start with by. We use by to talk about a deadline or a specific point in time. It means something should be completed or achieved on or before that moment. Submit your homework by Friday. So, in this case, you should submit your homework on or before Friday. I need to finish my project by Tuesday. Please have your homework done by the end of the week. We should arrive at the airport by 3 p.m. Now, let's talk about until. When we say until, we mean something happens continuously up to a certain time, but not after that. The library is open until 8 p.m. Here, the library remains open up to 8 p.m., but it closes at that time. The store is open until 9 p.m. It remains open continuously until 9 p.m. I'll be working until 11.30. I'll stop working at 11.30. We'll be on vacation until the end of the month. Our vacation lasts until the end of the month. Lastly, we have by the time. This is a combination of by and the time and is used to talk about completing an action before a specific point in the future. It's like finishing your work before a deadline. I'll finish my work by the time you arrive. So, in this sentence, it means that the work will be completed before you arrive. By the time I finish my coffee, the meeting will start. I'll finish coffee before the meeting begins. By the time she turns 25, she wants to travel to five countries. She plans to travel to five countries before turning 25. By the time we reach the concert, the band will have already started playing. The band will start playing before we arrive at the concert. Great job learners! To sum it up, buy is for deadlines or specific points in time. Think of until like a countdown. 
It's about something happening before a certain time arrives. By the time is about completing something before a specified future moment. I hope this video has clarified the differences between by, until, and by the time for you. Practice using these prepositions in your everyday conversations, and soon, you'll feel more confident with them. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more videos.